to the channel Bob here hope everybody had a great holiday I had a ton of fun with the family ended up scoring this really cool deep blue master 1000 I'll definitely be showing uh, more of that to you guys in another video today though we're looking at two really cool new offerings from Stratton watch company the watches we're looking at are the Stratton special these are vintage inspired chronographs and they are very cool so let's spin the camera around and take a closer look at the watches all right guys so the watches come with this really nice uh, case here you'll have a nice little slot for your watch and it comes with a spring bar tool the reason it comes with a spring bar tool is all of these watches come out with a matching striped nylon two-piece strap along with the leather strap you can also upgrade and get a bracelet on these i don't have one here but if you do upgrade uh, to the bracelet which i believe is around 40 us dollars you'll end up with a second strap which is one of the leather straps so a nice little bonus i think these uh, leather racing style straps just suit these watches perfectly i especially like the blue version here with the orange stitching very nice quality feeling straps if you take a look we have some heavy duty hardware here as well signed Stratton and uh, yeah nice just a nice match for these watches the watches have a really cool almost a vintage TV uh, style look to them uh, the case comes in at a case with the 42 millimeters we have no lugs here there, there it's an integrated lug but from the top of the case to the bottom of the case that comes in at 41 millimeters there's several options with these watches including case finish dial color movement you can have yours house either the Valju 7750 day date automatic movement which is in the black version of the watch we have here the other other option is a Mecca Quartz, the VK67. The blue version has that. That's a no date movement. The other difference between the Quartz and the automatic movement versions is going to be the case thickness. The thickness on the automatic comes in at around 15 millimeters, where the Mecca Quartz is a little slimmer at 13 millimeters. The lug opening comes in at 20 millimeters on both watches. We have water resistance of 100 meters, and we have a nice slightly domed sapphire crystal the dials here are both really well done i especially love how the sub dials have that raised outer portion giving the dials some the sub dials some great depth and dimension the squared off sub dials just give it a really cool vintage look they do function a little differently with the quartz and the automatic the quartz has the running seconds at six o'clock the minutes at the 12 o'clock and the hours subdial for the chronograph function at nine where the automatic has the running seconds at the nine o'clock position minutes at 12 and the hours here at the six o'clock position the tachometer has a nice slope down to the dial i really love also that pop of uh, pop of orange on both of these watches oh and by the way if you guys notice there's a couple of alignment issues particularly with the chronograph second hand on the black one here you'll see it's just a couple of seconds off of 12 these are prototypes and alignment issues will be corrected for the final versions the cases come in both be uh, bead blasted as well as polished finishes they're going to be coated in what Stratton is calling a clear DLC coating for a more durable case these ones are not coated again these are prototypes the final versions will have that coating the finish work is very well done on both of these and with these being prototypes I can only imagine it'll be even nicer in that final product the watches have both a screw down crown it's pretty large making them very easy to use and you'll see it's signed here with the Stratton logo the case back has a really cool speedometer deeply engraved with some info on the watch including which movement is in the particular watch so let's take a look at these on wrist here for a minute so on wrist i think these look fantastic if you guys aren't familiar with mecha quartz movements there's a combination basically of a quartz movement with some mechanical components that make the chronograph function have an automatic feel it has a bit of a snap to the pushers and also when you reset the chronograph which i'll do right now you'll see that it pops back to zero 
instantly versus a uh, regular quartz has a sort of a slower sweep back to zero and i really like that they've done that i also just want to show you the uh, side profile here on wrist this uh, quartz version has again the 13 millimeter case versus the automatic that is the 15 millimeter case so i'll show you the difference here now so there's definitely a noticeable difference. It's not bad to my eye, and on wrist, I barely notice it. I'm just going to fire up the chronograph function here while we take a last little look at the watch. At the end of the video, I'm going to be putting up loom shots of these. You're going to notice the hands aren't as bright as the hour markers. Again, these are prototypes, and that's going to be an issue that's fixed on the final product. So overall, I think the Stratton Special is a great watch. I just love the design. These are available on pre-order on Kickstarter until the 4th of January at about a 35% discount. I'm going to leave a link in the description below so you can go check out all the different options and pricing. But to give you a rough idea, the Quartz starts in, in around $320 and the Automatic is about $815. So that's it guys. Let's spin the camera back around and we'll wrap up today's video. All right, guys, so that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed our look at the Stratton Special. They are awesome watches. The watches are actually going to be heading out on a bit of a tour. Up next is going to be Scott from Watches Galore, then on out to California, where Aaron Dunlap and Chris at Marshall Time will be taking a look at them. So make sure you check out their channels. Links in the description below. Thanks so much. Have yourself a very happy new year. Be safe. Enjoy the families and have fun. Bye-bye.